it's been 84 years. Titanic, I... Uh, hey, Internet, I'm Steve, and welcome to Arapaho. <laughs> After three long months of waiting, Tress of the Emerald Sea is here. You've probably seen, like, hundreds of other people open it up, but now I'm going to open it up, and that's different for some reason. Because it's me, and you like me. The, like, 500 people who will watch this video like me. Book! It's here, it's here, it's here, it's finally here! <laughs> Secret project number one. Tress. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's open this baby up. So again, at this point, you've probably seen a bunch of other people open up their book. It's not going to be much of a surprise what's in here. I mean, obviously, it's going to be the book, right? It's Tress. We know it's going to be Tress. Am I excited? I totes am. Pretty shiny gold foiling. Indeed. Right off the bat, this fantastic. Oh, wow. I've been trying to not look at other people's unboxings of this. I know, like, what's in it. I've seen just scrolling and seeing everything. And, you know, you I know what's in it. But I haven't, like, looked at stuff yet. So this is lovely. That's a really, really, really awesome pin of Vin. 2023 begins the world premiere of Secret Project 1. Welcome to the year of Sanderson in April. It's fine. Oh, we find out actually who is doing the design of the Cosmere character pins. Sundara Tang. Sandara? Sundar? Tang. Got a Tress sticker, which is going on a water bottle almost immediately. A Tress sparkly... Ooh, it is a sparkly bookmark. With the art by Howard Lyon. And then, of course, an epic bookmark. Ooh! with actual, like, star charts. That's cool. These should theoretically be the same as the star chart in Arcanum Unbounded, if I recall correctly. We've got Threnody, which is a woman. Taldane is, was like, a tree. Roshar is the shard bearer. Oh, Nalthus and Skadriel are in the same... Oh, was that a woman? It's not as thick as their other giant bookmarks that they've done. The other ones have been, like, big old thick plastic and have not fit in books very well. This actually, this feels like it's cardboard, card stock. And so it's a lot thinner, which I actually appreciate. And then, of course, the whole reason why we're here. Oh, that is so pretty. So the foiling on this took four passes for each section, which is why it took so long. So you've got the black, gold, this light green, and then a dark green, and then a dark green, yeah. Four foiling processes on the front, four on the spine, and then four on the back, which is one reason why it took so long to produce. I'm pumped. I'm curious, of you wonderful viewers, who waited until getting the hard copy to actually start reading Tress? My wife hasn't read it yet. I devoured the ebook but she was waiting for the hard copy. So finally, after three months, I'll be able to talk about this book with my wife. That, oh, okay. You know what? Fine, I'll allow it. Worth the wait. A little pirate ship. Okay, not necessarily a pirate ship, but a ship on the background here. I like this cover a lot better than the Tor cover, mostly because every time I look at the Tor cover, it looks like Tress is standing on a rock holding a cell phone. Lovely end papers by Howard. And then the dual colored printing. And again, if you haven't read this, stop watching right now because I'm going to look at all the art because it's gorgeous. Howard, you did such an incredible job. Uh, as expected, uh, that's so cool. This is lovely. Hey, there we go. Yeah, that's a really cool effect. I love that. Going from the emerald to the crimson sea and then... Oh man, in that boat. And the main event, full page spread. <laughs> okay, so things I didn't notice when I did my initial like Cosmere Connections thing of Tress. We've got Hoyd, we've got him in socks and sandals, but if you look at his shirt, his shirt is the ghost blood symbol. The ghost bloods are making merchandise, you guys. Yeah, I love this. The front end papers are the cups, and then the back end papers, Huck, and then the broken cup. It's just, it's lovely. 
Howard Lyon did such a fantastic job designing this book. All right, we did it. We finally got Tress. Big thank you to my patrons. You're all Dougs in my heart, but mostly thank you to Doug. And also thank you to Matt, who is like Doug equivalent. Thank you to my other Dougs. You all are really wonderful and appreciate all of your support. Thanks so much. Okay, I know I promised at the end of my Everything We Know About Secret Project 2 video that my next video was going to be Cosmere Connections 4. I did not expect so many things to happen that were going to be worthy to make videos about. But Cosmere Connections 4 is coming, I promise. I'm finalizing all of the research right now, and I'm going to film it and edit it and get it out as soon as I possibly can. If not, like immediately after this, Cosmere Connections 4 is coming by the end of the month. I promise. The print book of Secret Project 2 should be coming out hopefully this month still. If you haven't read Tress because you were waiting on the hard copy, read and find out. If you're not waiting on the hard copy for Secret Project 2, read and find out. If you are waiting on the hard copy, you can soon read and find out. And that will be all I say. The end.